He's the only top-tier model who can walk the catwalk as a man or a woman and boasts one of the most recognisable and controversial faces on today's fashion scene. The androgynous Australian Andre Pejic has modelled for many of the big labels and has appeared on the covers of some of the world's top magazines. French photographer Sebastien Nick says Pejic has star quality. Definitely Andre's got these things that uh, the supermodel have, like, you know, how to pose in front of the camera. It's just, like, natural to him, like, he's got this talent, it's obvious. His striking looks have turned him into a trendsetter in an industry that's always seeking something different. In fashion, we're really, really hungry for something that's new. And that's something that Andre's brought more than any. I mean, there have been amazing female models that make people excited, but we want something new, and Andre's something new. He's something that just everyone wants to do a story with Andre. Everyone wants to do an interview with Andre. Everyone wants to dress Andre in their clothes. It's like everyone wants a piece of him. Because of his originality, because he's unique, uh, and because just so much attention focused on him, there is a very real possibility of getting overexposed. Pejic is aware of how fickle the fashion business is. He plans to study economics or law and has deferred his acceptance to a university in Australia. I'm comfortable with the way I look. I guess I'm lucky in that sense. Um, I don't feel the need to do that to change a lot. Um, I don't know, perhaps if, uh, you know, uh, if I had big muscles and I was really hairy and a beard, I probably might not be comfortable with that, you know. But, um, you know, like this I am. One of the highlights of Pejic's career has been to model the bride's dress for Jean-Paul Gaultier. It couldn't be further from his childhood. Born in Bosnia, Pejic spent most of his youth in a Serbian refugee camp before his family fled to Australia. 